to my channel and today I'm making a special soap for my my mom um, of course it'll be for sale in the Etsy store but it is with the Moonlit Path which is a Bath and Body Works dupe that my mom's addicted to so this one is going to be Moonlight Universe so it's going to be another universe soap so I'd like to do a shout out to all the soapers who came before me I've done the universe soap uh, starting with Mama Bass, Yellow Cottage Soapery, um, the Royalty Soaps. I think just about everybody has done one now. But I always like to shout out the ones who've done it before me. Okay. So in here I've got my oils. My clay. Oatmeal. What else do I have? Cream. Heavy cream. <laughs> Sorry. So I'm going to go ahead and buzz this up. And then I'm going to add my lye solution, which is aloe, lye, tussle silk, and sodium lactate. This is going to be a one color soap. And of course, it'll have soap shreds in it. For stars, I hope. But we'll see. We are soaping at room temperature. However, that being said, I don't know what to expect from this fragrance oil. I've never used it. So I am going to mix my color first. The only thing I'm doing here is mixing the clay in with the fragrance oil. I like to do that. Okay, so I'm going to be using Klein Blue. And because I want this to be like a navy blue, I'm going to be adding some activated charcoal. So let's see how this goes. I might need some more blue. No, I might put that away. I'm always afraid to add too much charcoal because it can go black really quick on you. <laughs> Not the blue I'm looking for. I need more blue. I might need more charcoal too, but I definitely, definitely, definitely need more blue. I had a feeling I would need more blue. I keep putting the lid back on because I'm a spiller. I spill stuff. <laughs> Anybody who's been around for a while knows that. <laughs> I make messes. And it's getting thicker faster than normal because it's so cold outside. So the, you know, like the coconut oil and stuff is 76 degrees well. <laughs> you know, we're getting down there, so. And then it starts to become a solid. Okay. Um. I need to put my fragrance oil in before I put the soap shreds in and I'm a little bit nervous, I am not going to lie. Because this is kind of a floral. Not a complete floral, but it's got floral notes to it. And you know, everyone knows what that means. It could go from zero to soap on a stick in literally seconds. <laughs> but I think we're doing okay here. Okay. Feeling better about that. Now, before I get crazy, I did not bring anything to pour off my top, and I don't want shreds in my piping bag. Whew, Nicole, Nicole, Nicole. This smells like my mom. And by the way, my mom's not very old, so when I say that, it does not smell like an old lady. It smells really good. Bath and Body Works, too. Um, I need to go get something to pour off some of that in, too. Sorry guys, no matter how prepared I think I am. I'm not. Just not. Oh, that's plenty for the top, I think. Oh, <laughs> look at the See? Spiller. I'm a spiller. 
Lord, oh mercy, Lord, oh mercy. Why, Nicole? Why? Why can't you just pour like a normal person? That's to be spilling all the time. Oh, then I'm nervous. I better put a little bit more. <laughs> you know what that means? I'm going to spill some more. Okay, you know it. You knew it was coming. Okay. Okay, now my soap shreds. And like many other soapers this time of year, we have got a lot of soap shreds. So you see a lot of soap shred soaps. Confetti soaps this time of year. Um, anyway. But I also have soap balls that will be going in there. And I just do this so that maybe, 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 maybe it'll look like the stars. And I'm, so I'm not putting in as many as I do normally for a um, confetti soap. But it is a confetti soap nonetheless. I'm going to pour some in and then pause and put in some of my balls. Soap balls. And I've got them in all sizes and colors here. But, wait a second, the bigger ones are in here. I think I should probably put the bigger ones here instead of trying to put them up top. These will sink some. That's okay. These are just my little planets. Get in there. Oh, I love these soaps. I don't know. I just, I love them. I just think that they're fabulous. So this is not accelerating. If anything, it may actually be decelerating. It is, however, warming up. So I have to keep an eye on that. Oh, please don't move them all over the place. It wants to keep moving the balls. Okay, so we'll put some more in here. Because this is the fun part of the soap, right? I don't know. I think it's really cool. It's my favorite part of the soap. Of these planet soaps. The universe soaps. Okay, I only have two. Pick it out. Okay. I think I might have some more over there, but that's all I'm going to put in here. And it has dispersed a lot of soap, so I might not have poured enough off for the top. That's okay. Because I put in more balls than I planned on. Nope, you have to all be buried. Don't be trying to float up. That's not the game we're playing today. Alright, I'm not getting <laughs> any more in there. And that's okay. So, like I said, it um, decelerated trace. So, and that's actually not quite the darkest blue I wanted, but that's okay. It's still going to be pretty. Um, and it's too thin for me to even bring it up and show you, but let me try to do a zoom in here. Sorry guys. Can you guys see? Alright. So I'm gonna bring you back when it's time to pipe. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great day. Hey guys, welcome back and we are going to pipe Moonlit Universe. That's what I'm gonna call it. I hope so. Um, it's been sitting for a while. Hoping it's thick enough to pipe. Find out. Sorry about all the noise. Wayne is busy. No, I'm not. Bringing in the stuff. Stuff. Come on, guys. Let's 
thing is really loud. I'm just gonna say. Okay, I love you, but you have to move. <laughs> He's talking to the big guy, our master. He's always underfoot and he's too big to be underfoot all the time. I was like, Jingle Bells. <laughs> perfect, perfect consistency for piping. Hey, little man. Coming out nice. Thank you, honey. Oh, I love piping soap. So cathartic. Alright, guys. I'm gonna stall it on the top. Let me glitter her up, of course. be my soap if she didn't have a whole bunch of glitter. Oh man, I'm walking right in here. What honey, I'm on videoing. Sorry. What'd you do? I said I walked those right in here. Spiders? Nope. I don't Lights. even want to know. Huh? Lights. 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 Oh, outside ones? Yep. <sighs> Oh, so clear. Okay. Now for the glitter. Are you done with the top? Oh, wow. There you are. Pretty. Yes. I need a little bling. She needs bling. Thank you. So cloudy today. I do not know. I think I'm going to do some silver. Excuse me, so Sometimes these pump sprayers do not spray like I want. So it looks like I'm putting so much on and I'm not. It's going everywhere but the soap, I swear. Oops. I think this one needs to be refilled in a bad way. Pretty sure. That it's pretty close to empty here. So, and then I guess I'll put some regular glitter. It also needs to be refilled. It's just iridescent. It's all biodegradable glitter. Yes, I gotta refill these things. These uh, pumps are from where? Uh, oh, so this right one's on. actually from Vicente. The rest of them are from Nurture. Okay. And a little bit of alcohol. We're good to go. And then I'll give you guys a close up. You get to see the shiver? Kind of. Kind of, not really. I see it. All right, yeah, I can see it. When you guys buy this, you'll see it too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll see you in a few seconds for the cut. Hi hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and today we are cutting uh, Moonlit Universe. It is a dupe of Moonlit from Bath and Body Works, my mom's favorite, so let's try by getting this end piece off. We do have a lot of stuff going on on the inside, so we'll see. That's the end piece. It's pretty, pretty. It's a little bit lighter blue than I wanted, but I can work with it. And it's very tall. The soap cutter's struggling here. Okay. It's so cool. I don't know. I like it. I like it a lot. It's very tall. I never think about packaging when I'm making these soaps this big. <laughs> because they don't fit in the bags when I get them this tall. So. Yeah, they're tall. Tall, tall, tall. So. It's my hand, and I have a very big hand. But yeah, they're tall.
I like toss up though. Oh, come on. Okay. If you're new to the channel, welcome to our YouTube family. If you're enjoying this, please hit the subscribe button and tap that little bell next to it to be notified of all of our future videos. The soap, I love it because it's so different from one side to the other. Totally different. Ooh, didn't mean to do that. And if you're not following us on Instagram, please go do that. We post, um, you get all the sneak peeks. Yeah, my mom is gonna love this. It smells just like her, because it's what she always uses. It smells very good, guys. Very good. It's pretty. Please don't forget to to give us a like and leave a comment down below. I really love the comments. They inspire me. Okay, come on. Okay, come on. Oh, lordy mercy. The soap cutter's like, I'm so done with your tall soaps. <laughs> over it. This will be the final cut. Oh, we got a piece of shred trying to come out here. Okay. And that is the final soap. I really like it. Lots of planets in there. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching, and I hope that you have a really great day. It just occurred to me that I have never shown you guys how I bevel, and I actually use a potato peeler. And I just, I don't know, I like, I like the way it works. So, I just very lightly, not too much, just very gently. If you pull, push too hard, you take off too much, and then it doesn't look good. But this is faster to me, and usually if I'm not filming, I go much faster. It is faster to me than using a beveler. And it's just less equipment you have to have, right? Ooh, I pushed too hard, see what I'm talking about? Uh huh. So, then I just, oh, this does stand up, it was my, just check it, make sure there's no, let's see, and it's all nice and beveled, and ready to be stamped, which I will let Wayne show you, okay, bye. Okay. Hey guys. I get the fun thing of doing the stampy. I'm kidding. <laughs> well, first thing I'm trying to do here is trying to put some of this gold on the our uh, stamp here. It's like floating everywhere, by the way. Yeah. Um, remember, this soap is very fresh. Not like your two week old soap. So. Yeah. Just keep so, that in mind. So don't press hard. <laughs> okay. Hey, that's plenty of gold, yes. Am I over, you know, squishing I it? I think maybe it would be better to just dust it on, but okay. Go ahead. Okay. Is that, is that upside down? It just looks upside down to me. Okay. Alrighty. She says I have to be very gentle. No worries. Uh... Seems like you're pressing pretty hard there, buddy. Yeah, honey, I am. Okay. Why? I have no idea. It's hard already? Yeah, a little bit. 
Well, I gotta be careful because you don't want to pull the soap off. Oh, that's pretty. Okay, show them. What it looks like. Very cool, right? Woohoo! Coco, stop. Behave yourself. Just trying to get this, uh, the, uh, the excess. So you, so you're trying to, you know, we're trying to be like all cool looking. <laughs> it looks awesome. I know, I'm just using you guys. Okay, we'll just do one more for the camera. Maybe if we do this. Let me see if this will work better. It will. You know, hey, it's called, let's try it. See if it works. So, we don't want all There's that. There's like a thousand pounds of glitter in our house, I swear to God. Uh, yeah, I know, it's like in the air. It's I like, clean glitter off of everything. It's all like, the time. oh my goodness, it's every. It's even on the soap. Holy smokes. Okay, it's fine. The soap can handle glitter. Glitter, glitter. Okay, here we go again. Sorry, dude. Okay. I sure hope I did this right. <laughs> what do you mean? Is it upside Not upside down. down. <laughs> I'll kill him. I'll kill him. Okay, he's got it right. <laughs> oh, that would be so bad. You guys be laughing. <laughs> Voila. Ready? Before. After. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great day. Woo